My name is Javier Verdura, Director of Product Design at Tesla Motors. I'm an industrial designer by education. I went to Art Center College of Design. Industrial design is combining art with functionality, practicality, and the ability to make something commercially viable. When I was at Art Center, I remember designing objects that were really, really cool and exciting and, and stylish and impossible to manufacture, perhaps. That dichotomy of like, okay, this is really great, but can you make it, has really shaped the way I think about design. And anything that I design that's functional, it is practical, it is easy to use, but that can be manufactured for reasonable cost. It's making people's lives better with things that can be commercialized. People that buy a Tesla are buying into not only the car that they're driving, but the philosophy of driving an electric car and the vision that Elon Musk has set out for the Tesla brand. Tesla brings up passion in people. I'm responsible to make sure that the brand never strays away from the, the core mission of having a, a premium brand, a brand that is about simplicity and just essential design. So we're standing here in the uh, in the supercharger outside the Tesla design studio. This is the tip of the spear, basically, for, for Tesla. This is where we come up with the designs for the cars, for all the infrastructure for charging, anything that's Tesla related. There's 120 people employed here. It includes designers, prototypers, model makers, clay sculptors, you name it. And the Tesla brand is young, and it has to be shepherded, and it has to be nourished. Anytime they come in contact with Tesla, in any way, shape, or form, they have to have the same experience as they have with this fantastic car. For example, the superchargers you see behind me have to be designed both functionally and as an icon for the future of mobility to replace the icon for gas pumps. Having this environment where you're charging your car that feels futuristic, and every person that owns a Tesla can use the superchargers for free. So anything that they have to come in contact with has to be designed. It has to be an amazing experience. Tesla's a technology-driven company first and foremost. The goal is to promote the advent of sustainable mobility for the world. To do that, we started with a car. We all knew electric cars before Tesla as being something that you compromised on. It's going to be kind of goofy looking, it's going to be slow, it's going to be not as practical as I want it to be. And when Tesla came along, we created a car that was the best looking car, the fastest car in the world, the most comfortable car, and by the way, it's a car that's electric. The car itself has several innovations that are unusual and disruptive in the automotive industry. The lack of all the components in a regular internal combustion engine car allowed us to fit seven passengers. In the inside of the car, there's a 17-inch touchscreen that controls everything. The car is always connected. It's like a cell phone on wheels. We don't use the traditional model of dealerships. We sell our cars directly to the customers. And our stores, our showrooms, are in areas where you would not find a place to buy cars. They're in malls, they're in high traffic pedestrian areas. We don't sell cars to our customers, we educate people about our cars. You don't go and haggle with a salesperson. You place your order online, and then five weeks later, the car is built for you at the factory and delivered. So it's a very different model than purchasing a regular car. We've also disrupted the energy storage industry. Uh, we just launched the Powerwall, which allows you to store energy from the sun, from your solar panels in your house. You can say that's only an energy storage product, but it's gotta be beautiful, it's gotta fit in the architecture of your house, and it's gotta match the expectations that people have of a Tesla brand. People are so loyal to the brand and so into it and so passionate about it. The feedback we get from them is constant, and we improve our products based on that feedback from our customers. A huge part of that improvement is what we call over-the-air updates. Any other car would be obsolete the day you take it off the lot. In the case of Tesla, you wake up one morning, your car can become faster, your car can become better. The interface is different on the screen, you have extra features. This September, over the air, we introduced the autopilot. Some people bought a car in 2014. They didn't know that that car a year later would be a self-driving car. Self-driving cars are gonna be ubiquitous in five years. And that's gonna connect with services where you call a car and the car is gonna show up to you and is gonna drive you somewhere without a driver. I think that's gonna solve a lot of traffic problems. Most of this car is gonna be electric. This is gonna solve a lot of pollution problems. It's gonna be a massive disruption in the, in the future of mobility for all of us. Innovation is gonna come through technology. There's no question about it, and we've proven that with the Model S. But innovation through technology cannot travel alone. 
It's got to come along with design and a very high level of design to match that level of technology. People expect that, people need that, and it's just part of the model, otherwise it won't work. Thank you.